Hello everyone, this is Joe for Soft Corners here. And for today's video, I have uh, mail day. This is coming from uh, my friend Eddie at Eddie's Cardboard Chaos. Um, it started with a comment on one of his videos. He had a bunch of his customs left over. And uh, <clears throat> when I first started watching Eddie's videos, I, I think around the National last year, I heard people after the National, I heard everybody's recaps um, was talking about him. And I believe I saw him. I'm actually in his national recap video. I'm like three feet away from him at one point, but um, I was in my like awkward, not, um, you know, just introducing myself to everyone phase, which I definitely would be out of now. And, um, you know, made a lot more connections through comment and stuff now in a year's time. But um, Anyway, that's uh, when I started watching Eddie's channel. Love his channel. Just love his collection and attitude about collecting and his humor and all that. Um, but so because I was reluctant to, you know, introduce myself to more people, uh, missed out on getting his custom. So uh, in a recent video, he asked if anybody was interested in one. So I just commented I was. And then at the same time, he was running a contest. Um, if you had to comment your favorite non Hall of Fame player to collect, I believe that's what it was. Um, and I just commented and ended up winning, so I know that's in here and it's custom, but I believe there's more. So, um, uh, I think I it was just my address, I probably showed, so that's okay. Um, I just cut these open to begin with. Oh, nice. Okay. Um, all right, so here are the two cards I know. First off, I can tell you already the best card in this is going to be this autographed Eddie's Cardboard Chaos card. So, really glad to pick that up. Nice customs. Okay, and here is what I won from his contest, which is really cool because I do not have any cards from this set autographed I've never done any TTM cards myself um, and I believe this might be my first actual TTM autograph I own at all so this is Frank Thomas no not that Frank Thomas the other one <laughs> um, autographed action pack so that's really cool I was really happy to <clears throat> really starting to try and build my auto collection more and more and eventually probably trying to get into sending some TTMs but have not yet so um, it's a great addition to the collection there so thank you Eddie for those and thank you also I I'm double check I don't believe there was a note oh there was a note I'm an idiot okay Oh, okay. Um, so I just want to read it first. So, uh, Joe, thanks for being such a great supporter of the channel and hobby friend. I hope you can use some of these 64 dupes. If you like them, maybe you can promote 64 back above 61. Uh, best wishes, always Eddie. So in my um, showcases where I was showing off the cards I had from the 60s, uh, I... I ranked 64 in the middle of the pack, and I believe I've had 61 either one or two sets above it. So this is his bribery to try and get me to move it ahead. So we'll see if it works or not. Um, but let's see, we got 
Chuck Hinton. These are really nice for my collection <laughs> as far as um, condition. Merit, um, Renu, Renu. Steve Ridzik. Uh, <clears throat> so I know uh, Bill Bruton. I know Eddie is building this set and I think he's doing this hybrid Ken Johnson where the ones he can get autographed TTM he's doing. Barry Latman. So uh Eddie, you'll have to let me know if any of these guys do TTM. I think that would be, if they do or any of us, any of them are with us yet. Really nice Phillies card here. Uh, let me know. Maybe that would be a great, maybe, attempt for me to get started doing it. And uh, from somebody who's very well versed in doing TTM, um, it'd be kind of cool that the cards came from you and I'd be able to get one signed by some of these guys and lastly here Dave Stenhouse and some of these are semi high numbers I believe they're semi high I, I know they're not high numbers yet but I, I think there are some semi high numbers this is card 498 so but really nice looking cards overall um I'll definitely this was a set I didn't know <clears throat> I kind of put it in my maybes if I'd ever build um but it definitely, um, there isn't like any of the cards that makes it like unattainable. So I, I think this, just seeing these in a nicer condition than I normally have really kind of maybe is pushing this above the, towards the mark of that I will probably try and take on a full set build of this because these look really nice when I just look through them. Um, but Eddie, thank you very much for those and for these. I appreciate it. Um, everyone else, thank you for watching. Uh, I'll have Eddie's info uh, linked down below in the title or description. And um, everyone else, thank you for watching. And just remember, any card can be a great looking card, even if it has four soft corners. Thank you.